camera. This is the Black Magic Ursa Mini Pro G2 4.6. We just got it uh, here at Specular this summer 2019. And I thought we'd talk about it for a minute, see why I like it, what's going on with it, and uh, show you some footage we shot with it. So here we go, the camera. It's kind of cool because it, it has all the controls on the outside, kind of like your traditional uh, ENG style camera, as well as having a pop-out screen. So you get to be able to adjust stuff while you're on the fly. You, you have some stuff over here, you got your ISO, your shutter, your white balance, you can adjust each one. It's got a flip switch that goes between your headphones, your monitor control, and your iris. So you can use this to adjust iris when you're working with a lens that has a um, iris control built into it versus a manual lens. Right now we have a traditional Canon 24 to 70 on here. So you got iris control built in. One of the really cool things I like about this camera is the fact that it has really good high frame rate capabilities. And it's got just a quick switch to go back and forth between your regular and, and high frame rate modes. So you can do 300 frames at HD. It doesn't seem like that'd be a lot, but actually 300 frames is really, really slow. I mean, that's getting down to the point where it used to be specialized cameras that would do 300 frames. Back in the film days, man, getting it to 1,000 frames was super expensive. So having a camera off the shelf for less than 7,000 bucks, you can do 300 frames at HD, and it does 60 frames at full 4K. So you actually can do pretty good slow motion even at full 4K. This camera is super flexible. It has the ability to work with a PL mount, EF mount, you can use it as an ENG camera on your shoulder where you're controlling the buttons, or you can flip it out and use it as a cinema camera. Really like that capability for the price point. The lenses you can use for it, you can use a broad range of stuff. Right now we have an EF mount on there. We're using the traditional 24 to 70 Canon lens on there. You can switch it to PL, use some Cook Primes, use some Anamorphics. And we have tons of these lenses here right at Specular. You can package them with the camera, try them out, see which is gonna work for your show. Okay, well, you know, you can totally get into the weeds and get into all details of this camera. And, you know, the point of this video is not really to get into what every function does, but the camera has a really good image for the price. I've kind of converted to liking Blackmagic. I've always been kind of more of an Alexa or Red guy, and I still love those cameras, of course. But for the price point, uh, this does an amazing image and really, really is nice to work with. We have some of the small cameras, the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema cameras, and this could be the A camera if those are running as B or C camera for, for it. Intercuts pretty well, and I'm sure we'll have the new 6K one as well very, very soon. All right, we shot some footage with this camera. We're gonna put it at the end of this video. Take a look at it, let me know what you think. Let me know what you think about the camera too. All right, take care, and we'll talk to you again soon. you like that footage and this camera in general but please let me know hit me up in the comments below we want to keep making these videos and show you all these different cameras so let us know take care <laughs>